everyone, what's going on? Joey Contino here, and I just want to take a moment out of your day to talk about last week's episode of The Masked Singer. Because there was one character who was revealed, who is a legend, Michael Bolton himself revealed as the wolf, or the wolf revealed to be Michael Bolton. And if you're like me, I watch that show religiously, and I know every character, and whenever we get someone big like that, it's always a great surprise. But I found it really interesting to see Michael Bolton not really be Michael Bolton. If you're a true fan of Michael Bolton, you would know this guy not only has a lot of personality, but also loves to move around. And if you watch last week's episode and the way that he performed, it didn't seem like My Michael Bolton at all. It really did not. I just want you to go ahead and really check out this performance. A little clip just because I know YouTube will hit me with a copyright strike, but take a look and tell me does he move at all? Take a look. Name the scene with Tariq, eye to eye, in the street, deep and wide. All that I've been living for is gone. So me being me, I started doing research because that does not look like the Michael Bolton I know. I'm talking about the funny, the goofy, the guy who moves a lot, has a lot of personality, and he's on stage barely moving and every article i can find online has nothing talking about his health we know like back in 2019 i think maybe like a doctor told me he had to sit down but it's because maybe maybe he was sick of something but he didn't look good and it's michael bolton for crying out loud he's a good singer and a great performer and he didn't make it past that first round of that episode it was such a red flag to me. It's almost like the producers wanted him to go out first and just do the show so that his family can see it and he can have a little bit of fun. And, you know, it really didn't hit me until I watched his unmasking interview that Fox and the Masked Singer put up a few days later and him talking about the love of his life being music and things like that. And I'm like listening to this and I'm hearing a man pretty much speak on TV about his life and everything he's loved in his life and music has always been his life and so on and so forth. It doesn't sound like he's talking about like, I had a great time on the show, but it sounds like he's saying goodbye to the world. I don't know. It sounds really goofy to me. I'm gonna play a little clip for you. Take a listen. Tell me what kind of vibes you're getting from it. Listen. The love of music has been the most consistent love in my life. You need to sing your heart out. You need to have fun. And if you can do both at the same time, you're in great shape. So I don't know. The man just released a brand new album a few days ago. I was on March 8th, so he's been pushing that. And maybe he was just really, really off for this, but I don't know. There's a lot of Michael Bolton fans out there. I know there's a lot of them. Believe me, I've been to a concert. Everyone knows every single song. So the question is in the comment section, as a Michael Bolton fan, does he seem off to you or is it just me? I don't know, I've actually... <laughs> I have pondered this since the episode to the point in time where I've spoken to other Michael Bolton fans to be like, yo, did you see that? That seemed like Michael to you because it does not seem like to me. And all of us kept on saying the same thing over and over again, that either he was having just a really, really off night, maybe he was really sick, or there's something bigger going on. And maybe this last album is his last hurrah. I mean, I don't like speculating things like that. But, you know, it j just didn't seem right. Like, I feel like we're expected a big announcement from him in the coming weeks. Because I don't even think, did he even announce another tour yet? No, right? I mean, not as far as we can find. But anyway, once again, let me know in the comment section. And if you haven't done so yet, please subscribe, turn on notifications, and give this video a thumbs up. I'm Joey. Stay safe. See you later. Bye.